Army of Two, last part of this level. What you gotta do now is there's three bombs and you have to carry them up some stairs and plant them at three little weak spots all around this uh, satellite dish at the top. Yes, and I think what grabbing the first bomb triggers the first wave of guys. Mm -hmm. And I believe planting the first bomb triggers the next wave of guys and then planting the next two bomb like I, I believe planting each bomb oh I changed gun decorations I don't think it had those bubbles on it before mm. um, <laughs> um, I believe that um, each bomb you plant triggers a wave of guys so what I found out works best is that if we time planting the second and third bombs to be right next to each other because mm -hmm. then that wipes out one of the waves of guys mm. And you can avoid killing all of them. And so while that guy's reviving you, look who's healing me. Look who's yeah. actually helping out. Me. I'm getting the bomb ready to go. Oh, that's not helpful. Yeah. Well, you didn't. We didn't have that theory when we were playing. What? To make plant what? the second and third at the exact same time. We did that. No, we didn't. I'm pretty sure that we. Why am I carrying the second one? Because you didn't tell me that. Are you sure about right. it? Well, let's, we'll, let's, we'll let's see, see how happens. it plays out. <laughs> let's see. You dropped it. Yes, I did. Mm. Mm. Anyway. You got to be careful, too, when you plant those bombs, because the, the next waves of guys come from all over upstairs, and they might come from, like, right behind you, depending on who plans, plants the bomb. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe... You well, you got this Why is that guy just one? like staring at me? <laughs> Smart AI, I guess. Yeah. So I plant the first one. Get a little checkpoint. Actually, I don't know if that's a checkpoint, but. Yeah. You sure that wasn't the second one? Yes, I'm 100% sure, because you have the second one in your hands. Oh. All right. You yeah. dick, you placed it. Yeah. I told you. Damn it. You I never heard of that strategy until now, so you didn't make it verbally clear mm. to your partner. Well, anyway, which if you're is watching this, crucial in Army of 2 to tell your partner the strategy. So if you're watching this video, there's a cat at the top of the satellite dish too. By the way, if you're watching this video and you you know the strategy and your partner doesn't, just let them know. Let them know. Via vocal noises. Mm-hmm. Vibrating those vocal cords. <laughs> that sounds like a dick-sucking <laughs> reference. <laughs> hey, baby. I'm going to vibrate your... No, I'll stop. Yes, thank you. I'll stop. So the area is pretty clear now. I just have to waddle my ass up to the top. I think uh, getting your wang mouthified is the best. <laughs> That's a Tim Meadows thing, right? Yeah. The ladies' man. That is, yes, that is Leon Phelps, the ladies' man. <laughs> Getting my wang mouthified. <laughs> that's hilarious. That's probably the best euphemism for... Yeah, now that's just getting, disgusting. <laughs> getting dome. What other good getting dome euphemisms are there? Getting dome, getting head, getting blown, oral gratification. <sighs> Mouthified. <laughs> I don't know. I can't think of any other good ones. <clears throat> so after you plant all three, you just have to wait. Uh, you have to run down the stairs, and that'll um, trigger the bombs to explode. And then you have to make your way all the way to the basement of this level. Which I didn't realize. I'm still shooting guys upstairs. Well, a bunch of guys spawned upstairs, and I think that if you just run for the basement. Oh, that's exploded. a heavy guy. Yeah, that's a heavy... I, I think if we had just ran, or we had lined it up better, they would have exploded with all the guys upstairs and we would have oh. been able to save some time. Once again, you need to make these things more obvious. Well, that part I'm thinking of right now, oh. the planting the second and third at the same time part, um, I, I remember from before. Anyway, that's not important. Yeah. What is important is getting your ass downstairs. 
which I'm not doing, and deciding whether or not you're going to take like a couple hundred thousand dollars, which is a lot of money in game. Yeah. To uh, let this girl get cock slapped. <laughs> mouth <It's> slipped in. <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? He's gonna slip it in? He's gonna mouth fire. <laughs> He's gonna mouth fire. That's terrible. Uh, there's gonna be a grenade launcher guy down at this first level that you drop down to. It's not too hard. He's in kind of a shitty position, though. Like, he's behind some good cover, and it was kind of hard to pull him out of cover. So I think I end up running behind him. And then let you kind of piss him off. It's and, nice when we you are absolutely nowhere near me. I don't know what the yeah. fuck you're doing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing either. <laughs> but I'm like looking for collectibles. <laughs> but I... <laughs> you're like looking for ammo oh. collectibles. Pick up a bulls. Yeah. Things on the floor. Mm -hmm. Money. Time. <laughs> <laughs> don't need to make that joke again. The shotguns are really, really powerful in this game, but they just don't have enough range. Like, I, I... I pick them up basically whenever I find them on the ground, but I'll never spawn with one, just because I don't like getting in situations where I have to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with people and get kind of overwhelmed sometimes, because the AI is actually kind of aggressive in this, mm -hmm. and they will charge you. Yeah, and it'd be cool if you could, like, make your secondary a shotgun. You... You can swap out your, um, not the secondary, but the heavy mm -hmm. gun, either the rocket or sniper or whatever. Yeah. You can have two primaries instead of a rocket launcher or Oh, I didn't realize sniper. that. I think so. I think I remember seeing that in it's one of the menu options. Mm. I don't, but hmm. I didn't really want to do that, so it mm -hmm. didn't matter. So, yeah, this is where I was... You remember I talked about before how I didn't think that that guy would be able to do shit to me when um, I got really close? Yeah. That's where he just whipped out the pistol and started <laughs> the shooting at me. Grenadier. Yeah. I love that grenade launcher. Yeah, it's pretty fun. I'm looking for it right now. I don't think I can... I don't think I ever found it. Oh, well. So just keep making your way downstairs. There's going to be... One more uh, floor of enemies to kill. They're not very hard, though. Just standard dudes. I don't think there's any anything worth noting. And that's the end of the hardest, longest chapter. Yep. The, the very last part of the last level is tough. When it has the two heavies and... Oh, yeah. The, on the stairs. Yeah, on the stairs. And there's turrets and mm -hmm. dudes everywhere. That part's tough. But um, other than that, it's not too bad for the rest of the game.